Um, I had to restart, man. I had to turn my phone off, but as brothers can see, I'm downtown Fort Wayne. But I'm gonna post in this spot right here because it's a little bit more drier over here, man. It's been uh, been raining all day. So it's a lot here for that. Make sure I'm rolling. Yeah, I'm good. But yeah, man, you know, pretty much, hey, um, you know, two thirds of our people are gone, man. You know, and this, this, you know, some of them, you, you, within, within a few minutes of actually talking to them, having a conversation with them, you will see that, man, it ain't no use in me even casting my pearls before swine. No, most of our people are through, man. You know, especially you fucking women. You know, Eve all the way out of order, and you know, Esau loves that. Because, you know, that's how you that's how you know our nation is in shambles. Our our women are a great example of that. They're they're a great embarrassment to us and, the, and themselves, you know. And Esau Esau pushes that. You know, Esau don't want feminine women. Hey, he, that's how you know this place is controlled. And it's under that vibration of Satan, man. You know, you know, he uh, he worships Baphomet. You know, and Baphomet is uh basically that's that's Shaitan. You know what I'm saying? It's, that's an idol. You know, and um, uh, he's 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 basically man and woman. You know, confusion. You know, and that's what you got, man. You want Esau wants the men being feminine and the women being masculine. You know, they want this shit all twisted and discombobulated, you know, discombobulated, man. For lack of better words. You know, and hey, man, that's why this, this devil got to get taken out of power, man. You know? But you know, you gotta think, why is it that people like Sexy Red or um, Blue Face, why do these people get pushed? You know, um, why why are we, you know, setting folly and great, that's what it is, man. That's all this place does. It sets folly and great dignity and the rich sit in low place, you know? Hey man, if you wanna find righteousness, man, finding righteousness is scarce and that's like, you know, Amos 8 and 11. You know, being able to, to, to tap in and hear the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai is a blessing because pretty soon the Lord's gonna take that away, man, you know? You know, and you, and you see that Esau doesn't push. You got a hey, Jake out here in middle school, you know, um, 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 with a with a with a with a with a college educated brain. You know what I'm saying? Creating things, and these are just things that I see on the internet, man. You know, you got uh, young brothers and sisters out there, you know, that are making great impacts. You know, but we're not putting them on the pedestal. We putting uh, that thug behavior, we put that diva behavior on the pedestal. We're push, they pushing that, you know? And that vibration is very, very destructive, man. You know what I'm saying, you know? But that's Esau, man. Hey, he paying Jake to push that demonic vibration, and then he going before the Heavenly Father and accusing him. Like, look at what they doing, you know? Hey, this goddamn devil is the author of all the confusion that is, that is in this world right now, man. You know, and, then, and right now, hey, you got to think, man, Shatan, he offered Yahweh Shah the world, basically the world and everything in it. So, the, hey, Job 9 and 24, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. He covereth up the faces of the judges thereof. That's what Esau did during the Renaissance period, man. You know, these the different period pieces that depicted Jake as in, in rulership. They were they all hidden in, in, in the Vatican, you know, and they whitewashed everything and basically rewrote history, man. You know? And and you gotta kinda dig to even you gotta dig to see that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Google, man, they are high results. So you gotta kinda look up uh di like different search engines. You gotta do different things like that, man, to get that information. But the information is out there, man. We ruled over there in uh in Europe during the so-called dark ages, you know? Um, Aristotle, that was a Jake, man. You know, Plato, I believe he was a Jake. You know, co you know correct me if I'm wrong. You know, um, Septimius Severus, 
uh, Marcus Aurelius. That's a Jake, you know. Hey, King James was a Jake, man. And, and, and the spirit was on King James to translate the scriptures, man. And no, he wasn't a homosexual. That was a, that is a lie. You know what I'm saying? Put out there, you know? Yeah, man. So like, um, one of the, uh, one of the elders, I believe it was Elder Taza Doc, but I was watching one of his videos and he brought out how Benjamin, um, I'm trying to think of his name cause I'm, it's, it's, it's slipping my mind right now. Um, Benjamin Franklin, yeah. Yeah, Benjamin Franklin wrote a letter, I mean, Salakia, uh, wrote a letter about, um, you know, Jake over there in, uh, in, in Germany and France and in them different areas. You know, the man who wrote The Three Musketeers, you know, that's a little gem that they threw in uh, the, Jank, the movie Django. You know, that was a Alexander Dubois. He was a Jake, you know what I'm saying, you know? And um, Levi, in the French, they got a hell of a history. That's why you got Levi out here speaking Creole, their own uh, variation of French, you know? Hey, those French, those that, that, they're just a different tribe of Edomites. They're all Edomites. The Russians, so-called Russians today are Edomites. Hey, Jake ruled over there. You know what I'm saying? When you see them guards standing, you know, with the, uh, with the fucking, uh, with the hat, they kind of, the hat kind of looks like an Afro, but that's because the original inhabitants of that land, hey, they thought it was Jake's dwelling over there, you know? And they um, wear that hat because they can't actually grow an afro, but that's, you know, uh, uh, a tradition, I would suppose. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm not very, very keen on that history, but I did see, uh, you know, I did look into that a little bit. You know, but yeah, man, um, when Benjamin Franklin described the inhabitants, over there, you know, in Europe, he described them as swarthy. You know what I'm saying? You know, and uh, a swarthy goes into being dark skinned, uh, what they call so called black. No, Esau, man, Esau's a, a, he's a tricky little devil, man. You know, because he's tricked Jake into denying their heritage and taking on wickedness, which is inherently what Esau is. We 